Will it warm up? Today, Michelle, what's the latest? Yes, yeah, so the temperatures today will be very similar to what we had yesterday. As we take a look at our current temperatures, though, this morning starting off a little cooler, and you can see the good visibility in the clear skies from our Providence City Cam. We're down to 34 now in Providence. Smithfield's hit the freezing mark. Newport's at 39, and New Bedford's running below freezing. So cold enough for some frost on the windshield this morning. They may have to scrape off as you head outside and uh, begin your Tuesday. We do have light winds. Our threat tracker remains in the green for today, tonight. Uh, but on Wednesday, I have us up into the yellow category. I'm not concerned about the morning commute, but more so towards the evening commute as we time out the arrival of some rainfall uh, towards the afternoon and evening. So it's Patricia's remnants. Rain may fall heavy at times with some gusty winds overnight. So giving you that heads up here early so you can you make some arrangements, just plan on possibly a slower evening commute. One of the concerns would be some leaf clogged storm drains this time of year. You get a heavier downpour and that rain doesn't have anywhere to go with all those uh, leaves coming down off the trees. Looking at our radar in across Rhode Island, southeastern Massachusetts, we're not talking about rain this morning. We're dry and going to stay that way through the day. High pressure sitting right overhead. That's going to keep us storm free again today. Now notice some high clouds that are coming in already from the south and west. Those will be with us over the course of the day today, turning our skies partly sunny at times. But all of this green that you see over the southeastern United States working its way up towards the uh, Ohio Valley. That's going to steer clear until we head into tomorrow afternoon. So I will be timing that out for you. But let's first talk about today. Mostly sunny skies. This is 9 a.m. 42 degrees by 11 o'clock up to near 50 for the afternoon mid to upper 50. So similar to yesterday, but with that added high cloud cover at times. Future cast for tonight. Not as cool as the clouds will be thickening. Temperatures mostly staying in the uh, mid to mid 30s to lower 40s. Now let's talk about the rainfall. So this is tomorrow morning at 6 a.m. Starting off with just increasing clouds, but dry conditions for the morning commute. As we look at dismissal time for the schools, that's around the time that we're looking at the first shower starting to press in. And it should fairly quickly turn to a more moderate, two times heavy rainfall that'll continue all through the night. So this is 11:30 Thursday morning, and the showers are starting to uh, clear out, and we should be drying out for your Thursday afternoon. So you're in your seven-day future cast: 57 for today, 60 for the high tomorrow. Starts dry, ends with the rainfall. Winds gusting 35 to 45 miles per hour Wednesday night. Rainfall one to up to two inches of uh, rain. Heaviest will be in the evening and at night. Thursdays high 67 degrees very mild some spots may even hit 70 and it'll be mild for the Patriots game up at Gillette Stadium Thursday evening 57 degrees a kickoff breezy and mild we do cool off for the upcoming weekend full future cast always 